Hello guys, this is Becca, and I am here with the open collab, hashtag deck the year. Uh, it is hosted by Penny over at Penny's Crafty Creations, and what you do is you take a, a playing card of any kind, uh, it can be a regular deck of cards, it could be a, a flash card, or uno card any kind of card and alter it any way you want to and um, upload your video with the hashtag uh, deck the year and tag penny in it and we are on week 20 this week we've been doing it since the first of the year penny did it last year also but i just found out about it at the end of last year so I didn't start until the first of this year we're on week 20 and this here is my card it's just a regular playing card and I put uh, some card stock on the back that has like branches with little uh, birds on it. I put this foam sticker of a barn. And yes, it does hang off a little bit. But this card is actually a little bit smaller than a regular size. So I feel like this will still be able to fit in my sleeve. Um, I'm trying to keep them where they'll go into the trading card sleeves. So I'm, I'm hoping this will still fit in the sleeve. Um, I, okay, I use for the card, for the scrapbook paper that I use for the background, I use this Echo Park 6x6, it's springtime. This is the, the one I used, and That's the pattern I used. I don't know if you're seeing that or not on camera. I used that paper. The foam sticker came from... I already threw the top part of the package away. I, I think it said... Um, Prairie Rose or something like that. It was, it's kind of a, a farming theme. I used my punch that I purchased with my gift card. One of the punches I purchased with my gift card that I received in a winning from uh, uh, Carrie, Carrie Crafts. And uh, I punched out two butterflies and I layered them so it would be dimensional. And then I put some words that I had cut from uh, magazines or whatever, wherever I got them from. It says, always remember, great things take time. So I put that as the sentiment on it. For uh, the middle, for the body of the butterfly, I used this um, Pops of Color. It's sort of like puffy paint, sort of, or like the, uh, what is that called? The um, something pearls, I can't remember now. But it's uh, scrapbook.com brand. You get it from scrapbook.com online. Then these little yellow dots I put around here is uh, the pops of color. Let's see if it tells the color name. This one's called, uh, this one's Lemon Chiffon. This one is uh, Deep Sea. Pearl Deep Sea. And that's Pearl Lemon Chiffon. So, oh, on the back of it, I just took a piece of that, the gingham, uh, paper that I cut the butterfly out of. I cut a piece 
I inked around the edges and I inked around the edges of the card and and the butterfly but I just I really didn't want it grungy I wanted it clean and simple but I did feel like it needed to be inked a little bit so I went with the pink color to ink it up then I took that gingham piece of uh, scrapbook paper and I inked around the edges of it and I've got on the back hashtag deck the year at Penny Penny's Crafty Creation Week 20 and 5 16 24 that's today's date and when my uh, pops of color dry is good enough I'll stick that in my sleeve uh, for my trading cards for deck the year and uh, I'm gonna keep mine until the end of the year and um, do I, I want to do a, a flip through of all of them for the whole year at the end of the year and show you all of them then if I decide to trade them out or you know send them in happy mail or whatever I will but for right now I'm keeping them but I'm really enjoying this thank you Penny for having this collab and allowing me the opportunity to participate I hope you enjoyed seeing my card I had to hold it up here so it'll stay focused I hope you enjoyed seeing my card and I'm gonna go for now hope you all have a great rest of your day talk with you later bye